Hey everyone, enjoy the show. Hey folks, how you doing today? So what we're offering this morning is a 1947 Schriever's Multiphone. In my day, you know, I've been in this for about 45 years, I've only seen maybe six of these. Uh, I've got two recently, I kept one for myself and I'm gonna sell this one. When we got it in, I knocked it down, sent it out, had it all completely polished, put new grill cloth in it. These were touted in 1947 as one of the mechanical, electromechanical wonders of the year. It got a bunch of awards. You're probably wondering, well, what the hell is the thing? So I was able to procure a magazine article about this. This was super neat. You know how you remember the uh, Seberg wall boxes which would sit in the booth and you would select a record and then the jukebox would play it. Okay, so this is different. On this one, what you would do is you'd put a dime in it, you would turn it on, and then it would go to a, uh, through a telephone and it would go to this station and there was women there that manned the phonographs. So you would select a uh, record off of the menu here, put your dime in it and you would talk into it. It was a telephone. You would say, hey, give me number 247. Thank you, Mr. Schaefer, you know, you got 247. Then this was the speaker, okay? So this was a telephone and a jukebox at the same time. You could communicate with it. I've opened it up here. This is the original lock, but I want to do is I want to show you inside of this. This is how it opened. I'm going to have Jeff come in here, okay? And see right here, once you put the dime in it, this was the part of the telephone you spoke in right here. And then down here was some more electronics. I'll try to give you a little peek here. This was the rest of the electronics. So once you put a dime in it, you would speak to one of the operators and ask her for your selection of the record. And it was at that point she would play it off site and it would come through the, through the speaker here on your, uh, typically in your diner booth. This was a fantastic product. It is about as art deco looking as you can get. Once again, these are extremely rare. In my opinion, I've only seen about a half a dozen. I got two, I was able to procure two, kept one, selling one, sent it out, had it polished. I believe with no problem that if you sent this to an old telephone guy, you could get it working, but what are you gonna hook it to? So, you know, you need this, okay? So you will get the paperwork, you're gonna get this, you're gonna get this, as well as I did get where there was one of their trucks got in an accident, which is kind of cool. So you'll get all the paperwork with it. This is a beautiful piece, Art Deco, polished, ready to go, rare. So anyway, if you like it, we'll box it up, we'll get it out to you. Uh, if you buy before noon, we'll have it out that day. Anyway, thanks for watching our videos. today so uh, we really want to tell you we appreciate you watching our videos we've done about 1600 of them to date and uh, you guys respond very nicely to it and we really appreciate it so if you like them man smash the subscribe button right
boom, hit the subscribe button and click on the reminder button. And if you do that, you will get reminded. There's a little bell there. Click on that. Uh, what we'd like you to do is make comments and please make sure you share it with your friends. You guys are taking us to the top of the YouTube channel. And if you do those three things, you'll be able to see uh, us real time, especially if you hit the bell to remind you. It'll come up every time on your phone. We try to do a lot of fun stuff for y'all, and we appreciate you watching our videos. So let's smash it. Let's grab it. Let's watch them. Let's comment. Let's send us comments. Share it with your friends. If you do that, you'll take us to the top, and we would really appreciate it. These are Mantiques. Antique, Mantique. These guys sell Mantiques. This is their store. We're picking, we're bringing stuff every day, in and out, in and out, in and out. We're, we're, we're shaking and baking. These are their customers. Give me the rundown on the GMC. This lived in a bar in Ghent, in Belgium. Follow Jim and Jeff from 9 to 5 or after hours as they buy, sell, and restore the coolest stuff for the coolest collectors worldwide.